the agents of Nightfold. With laryngitis. Yeah. <laughs> yes, it's been a tough week here in the agent's garage. Well, not in the garage, yeah. In the outside world, the garage has been fine. I've been stuck uh, in here all week. Pete, Pete's <laughs> here, which is why he sounds so rough. Uh, Pete's got uh, what, what? some sort of terrible Barry White. Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> affliction. Uh, and I've had the week from hell. But, you know, it's nearly Christmas. And so... This is all to be expected. Uh, we're going to try and, and, and uh, well, put, put something together that's entertaining. Yeah. We'll see how we go. You guys are going to love and it. You, um, we've rolled up for the boards. Uh, tonight we are playing the uh, Grotz versus the Skeletons. Hopefully you've watched our deck reviews, assuming they've arrived on YouTube due to our terrible weeks. Yep, yeah, um, they'll be there. <laughs> yeah, probably. Uh, but hopefully you've seen those, so you'll know that I really, really didn't want to win the roll this time. Yeah. And for once I did! Yay. I did win the roll despite not wanting to having, having lost some like 17 in a row yep. or one out of the last 17 maybe I won uh, I won today hooray the great. one time you didn't want to win so and already as a slight result of that I've had to dispatch three of my objectives actually nothing to do with that at all I've had to dispatch pure carnage fired up and escalation because frankly uh, I'd be hard pushed to score any of those you I will. think I think you would yeah. yeah yeah they're not the best ones to get at the start regardless of your deck no no, Which is a shame, really. Pure Carnage is just a lovely card to have. And this yes. just reinforces my belief that best of threes are the best way to go. Yes, well, if we had the game. time. Yes, then yeah, we but the more Patreoners who come along, you know. That's true. More of you YouTubers who sign up to Patreon as well. That's nice the little segue do. there. Yes, do feel free to sign up to us on Patreon. You can find the link below. Uh, do. It's really good fun over there. We've got all sorts of things coming up. We're going to take that, hopefully, to the next level in 2019. The next level! Um, with some of our lovely patrons helping us out. So uh, do come along and have a look. So, without further further ado, you see, uh, we haven't seen our cards yet, we're going to show you the cards in a minute, but we need to set up our models first. So let's roll and see who has to place the first model. I got, oh, oh I started losing the rolls now. I got just a double. Just a double. Oh, two, two singles, that's that just makes a double, double, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, so I win. Righty, so I will let you place first, not that it makes a great deal of difference. Oh, we've got to point out the first. objectives. I've got two, three and five here, and Robin has one and four over there. If five. I place first, doesn't that mean that I'll get the extra thingy dice? No, because you have nine models and I have seven. Then I place three of them at once. Oh yeah, that's a good point. Yes, mm. yeah, that's a good point. So yes, you would. Yes, I just I just thought I'd throw that out there in yeah, case you wanted point. to change your mind. Good point. So you want me to place first? Rules. I don't really know how to play these guys. I remember being destroyed by the uh, uh, the Oryx being destroyed by they them. They did, did get did get destroyed by them. Yes. But um, I cannot actually remember how. It's how you did that? So, I think it was mostly luck. Oh, okay, well that's all right then. That makes you feel a lot better. Last dollop of jamminess, <laughs> I think. Jamminess, jamminess. The Let's greatest have some gift ham and that I something, something ness. Right, I'm going to start with a little bit of red cap, maybe if I can work out who to. We still haven't got these painted. This one's red cap. I have a little bit of red cap down here. Now we will be bringing to you soon. Um, a battle cam and yes. we will be bringing you some painted models because a lot of our Patreon is very lovely of them thank you guys uh, have offered to paint some of our wall bands for free you guys rock frankly ok so you put red cap over there I'm going to put uh, Mr Furcoat there uh, Mr Furcoat hey I'm going to put stick it here you can stick it there I am going to stick it there Ooh. Mr. Crawley out of the ground over there. He's just coming out of that pile of skulls just here. Zarbag here. It's probably a mistake. I'm going to put Mr. Dramatic Pose over there. One of these guys here. That one must be uh, Dibs. Dibs. There. Okay, I'm on to my main guys now. I'm going to put the Warden here. Prog over here. Prog Dernetta. Okay, I'm going to put Prince of Dust there. Okay. I'm going to put there. the Harvester here. Okay, I'm going to put my hand. Oh dear, Drisky and the Squigs. Sounds like Ooh, a band. Ooh, Drisky and the Squigs. And I'm going to put the Champion there. Champion! Champignon, Monsieur Champignon. Cool. So now we've got a roll. So you goes first, and you get plus one crit to this. So I'll roll and see if I save you the hassle. I do. Okay. There you go, Robin. Ain't going your way. Maybe. I'm just gonna throw the plan out. 
match. That's my plan going out the window. Just going out the window. <laughs> I'm like, oh, I hope it was going to, uh, you know, take this carefully, cautiously. It's like, oh, shall I charge? I think it's charging time. <laughs> it might just be. Charge o'clock. So before Robin makes his decision, we'll show you our cars. Oh yeah, good idea. So Robiny Roo, what you gonna do? Robiny Roo, what you gonna do? Boo. As you can see, as I can't make much noise today, Robin is making it. <laughs> How many wounds has the Harvester got? The Harvester has three. Champion has three. Prince has three. Okay, then we've got three wounds. That's a bit disappointing. It is. Mm. For you. Well, yeah. <laughs> it, it was me that I was really thinking of. Uh, uh, typical. <laughs> you never think of me anymore. <laughs> I am going to go first. This is not a shocking moment. No. I'm going to charge with Snurk. Yeah. Plan. <laughs> <laughs> Out the window. Okie dokie. So Snurk rolls. Snurk has one sword. <laughs> I missed. Okay. But now he's going to inspire. Inspire. You know what I should have done though? What? I should not have thrown away fired up necessarily. I forgot he inspires really easily. Yeah, that is true. <laughs> I've yes. forgotten that completely. That's actually does, an inspiration. That does actually inspire yeah. really simply. Still not sure. Mm, not sure you could have sure. got escalation though. No. Possibly. Possibly. Mm, possibly, yeah. Oh, it's tricky. Yeah. It's hard to tell. But I'd have a glory now. Oh no, wouldn't it's not score immediately, is it? No. No. So there we go. Okay. We're off. Power step, oh, funny enough, I have nothing to play. You know, screw it, I'm going to throw all my plans out the window as well. So I'm going to play in your power step, Spectral Wings. Ooh, Spectral Wings. Oh, yes. And now, onto my go. Mm -hmm. Presuming you have nothing else. I have nothing else. I'm going to charge with the Harvester. Ooh, ooh, it's going to go one, two, ow, three. Oh, should have seen that coming. Well, only if you knew what cards I've got. Well, I suppose, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, yes, because he only moves two, do doesn't he? He does, yeah. So the Harvester is going to use his Whirling Scythe on you. It's only two swords, but okay. it's two damage, so it's okay. enough to take out your squigs. Mm. So I'm going to go for Bonecracker first. Okay. Two swords. One, One sword. sword. You do get double assist as well as your dodge. Double oh. assist. Oh. So I'm going to push you back to there. Okay. Uh, to there, actually, I think. And the next one, I'm going to go on the other squig. Okay. Uh, actually, no, I'm going to go on Zarbag, I think. That's uh, Drisket. Drisket, sorry, even. Yes, I'm going yep. to go for Drisket for the second attack. So, mm -hmm. swords again. Oh, one sword again. You get single shields this time. Oh, shields. So, I'm going to push me. him back as well. Okay. And then I'm going to go for the last squig, uh, Gobble Luck. Swords again. You can do with a crit this time. No. But you only get a dodge. No. Oh, you have killed a squig. One squiggling dead. So I get me a glory. He has charged. He has charged. Not sure if it was worth it, but you never know. And in my power step, I have nothing to play. I am not going to play anything either. Okay. I'm going to make a charge action. Okay. Which is get to there. I don't think he can't do his special action either, can he? No. Okay, yeah, because I was uh, think, hoping that he could scurry, but of course he can't scurry because he's a squig. Yes. So I'd have to use the special action for Drizgit, but then I wouldn't be able to attack with uh, said. I mean, you could move them both around, because I've only got a movement of two for the well, most that's part. That's true, so I could do the, the action, but then there's no point in doing the action. Bear in mind, my warden does have a move of two and a range of two, two. Yeah, so, so I, I could mm, still stabberate somebody. It's difficult, isn't it? Yeah. He can still move on his, of his own accord, can't he? Who's that? Uh, the, the squig. The squig. The squig you haven't taken any damage there, have you? Not yet. <sighs> okay, I'm going to make. I'm actually going to make a charge action to here. Okay. You must charge recount out. Yeah. So it's just two. It's two hammers, though. So it's two hammers. It's not shoddy. Two hammers. Oh, two hammers. So, so I need, need a crit. Need or a crit. He's kaputtened. He's not kaputtened. He's just damaged. Isn't oh, he? how much damage do you do? Two. Two. Okay, so the yeah, the half has two wounds. Mm, but we'll push him back to there. Ah. Squeak's gonna come a chomping. <laughs> it's gonna be like the uh, like the Pac-Man noise. <laughs> Nothing in your power step. Uh, no. 
We, uh, Robin played Fungal Blessing after my Harvester took somebody out and caused a wound to him, and then two more means he's kaput. So you get a glory. Thank you. And what will happen is, I'll blame the rest of the match on that if I lose. That's fair enough, that's fair <laughs> enough. Thank you for that. That you actually frees me up. Take my hat off to you, sir. Ooh. Just my okay. hat. And your power step? Power step! I've got nothing to play. Okay. So on to me. On to you. To me, to you. Oh. I'm going to use the warden's ability to move Ooh. two people. Move him to there. And we go brunt, brunt to there. Because that, that squig is a little bit too close there. <laughs> that, that fanatic is just a little bit too close for my liking. And that is the end of my turn. Okay, I'm going to play... I'm going to put the Fainway Crystal on... It's a bit suicidal. <laughs> I'm going to put it on Zarbag. So I have nothing else to play, so it's on to your second activation. No, your third activation. My third activation, I'm going to make a move action with Zarbag. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> it's a bold move, Cotton. Let's see how it plays out for him. I'm going to have to go after you with the warden, you realise this. I know that, yeah. He's, so he's moved. Zarbag has moved. Okay, and then your power step? I thought, about, I, I thought, should I wait till the last turn? But you might move on to the objective. That was or both, be my next both, thing. both was objectives. Be moved both of my exactly. So I had to do it. Yeah. <laughs> the question is whether I can kill Zarbag yeah. now. Yeah. And if I use somebody else, you almost certainly would have killed them. Yeah. So, and then it was a waste of a gambit. Yep. Yeah, well, not, li not literally a gambit, a figurative gambit, a figurative and one. not a game, not an in-game gambit. Anyway, I waffle. Yeah, you do. <laughs> Uh, and your power step? My power step, I have nothing to do. Okay, so on to my go. Which I do, actually. Ooh. I am going to do Ooh. something. Ooh. And bear in mind that uh, Zarbag's days might be numbered. I'm going to cast, try and cast, Abasoth's Withering. Oh. Oh, no, not Abasoth's Withering. Uh, that's not the one I thought it was. I really need to learn how, to, how these spells work. <laughs> yes, I am going to cast Abasoth's Withering on the Warden. Within, yeah. It's within four squares. It is. So I'm going to try. So what's it need? So it needs a lightning. So you get two of them, because you are level two. Oh, yeah. So I just need a lightning and not two crits. No! Oh. Okay, so I failed to cast Abasoth's Withering. Ooh. I have nothing in my power step. Same here, so on to my third turn. Right, so I've got to go for this. This could be the game changing moment, so I'm going to charge with the warden. One, two. He's going to charge his Zarbag. So, just the two hammers right now. Oh, a crit. Zarbag isn't inspired yet, so he's two, just got. Two dodges. Is this three damage? Two. Is it two? two? Is it three damage? It is two damage. It's two damage. He's got three wounds. Oh, a crit! Oh, I'm jammy. I feel but you still nope. take the damage. Oh, because no, I, I can't crit. push you back. Oh, did you do get a crit? I got a crit as well. Ah, yes, I do still take two damage. You do still take two damage. Oh, I, missed, I completely missed your crit. Oh, oh, oh I did not. <laughs> and then the power step, I'm going to play acrobatic on oh. the warden. That's, and then you're going to play melee for action. There you go. <laughs> That's what it sounds like with just one of us. <laughs> Certainly no harmonies going on there. Ow! <laughs> and I'm going to swing at you again. That was unfortunate! <laughs> right, stop it now. What do I get? Ooh, a hammer. Is that enough? It's enough. I need something. It's a no. shield. It's not enough. Zarbag's bag's bit in the it, dust. Oh, my gambit failed. Boo hiss! Ray. It's game over, man! Game over! <laughs> so I get another glory, and I also score Skills Unforgotten. No, not Skills Unforgotten! No Yay. way, you never score that! I never score it! <laughs> I, got it. I don't know what's happening! Uh, I don't understand anymore! It's all gone, Pete Tong! And in my power step, I'm gonna play Butcher's Eye on the Prince of Dust. <laughs> Anything for you? I'm quite sad now. I'm not. <laughs> Or I get another objective. 
Okay, I'm going to play Spectral Wings. Ooh. And then I'm I'm not going to play anything else. So over to your next turn. Hmm. Your fourth and final activation. Fourth and final activation. What, so I'm going to move, so I'm going to make a move action. With your spectral wings. With my spectral wings go one, two, three, four, five. And I can well, move him. Can scurry, I can yeah. move him also, can't I? He can. And he only moves three. I'm going to go one, two, three. Oh. Why could you do that? I assume he does count for... for uh, I assume so. It just says just, that squeaks can't capture objectives. Yeah, but he... But he um, well, is that what it says? Does it say squeaks can't you hold could, objectives? You could move him where, where he is at the moment. I don't want you to. Yeah, yeah. So I've, I've doubled up there. It okay. just says they can't hold objectives. Yeah, so I think they can't hold yeah. the main five or however many you got. But they can help score objectives. Yeah. So that's it. And your power step? Uh, uh, was a, no, uh, uh, no, nothing in my first step. Okay, I've got nothing to play, so onto my fourth turn. I'm just going to move Prince of Dust two to there. And into my power step, I have nothing to play. Nothing? Nothing at all. Okay, I've got nothing to play, I don't think. I'm trying to decide whether I want to do something. No, there's no point, so I won't. Okay, so we're on to the uh, end phase of the first round, mm. and you went first. I did, and I have scored extreme flank. Oh, I'm surprised by that. So I get two, which means I inspire. Bling! All the grobbly goblins inspirings, but not squigglings. And you score any other objectives? No, and I'm going to get rid of infestation. Score this name phase if you hold every objective. That's a tough ask. I know it is. That's but I, you know, I just ask. thought I'd go for it. Yeah, yeah. I've got yeah. Abras Abrasoth's... Withering uh, Gordon. No, no, I'm I'm destroying one. Yeah, but I can't yeah. cast that now. No, so, true. and if I got three and I got rid of one, then maybe I could maybe I could score it. Yeah. But I'm not going to get it now. No, true. <laughs> and you're going to keep your last one? I uh, will hold on to my last one, yes. Okay. And power cards? Power cards. I'm going to keep the one I have and draw another... Uh, well, however many I need to draw? Four. Okay. So for me, I scored Master of War. I have played a power card, an upgrade, and scored an objective. I'm going to get rid of Battle Without End, which is bring two people back. Because only one's out right now, and I don't really know if I'm going to want to bring many back. I'm going to keep my last objective and my last upgrade. And, you know, in fact, I'm going to get rid of my upgrade. I'm going to get rid of the Mutating Maul. And I'm going to draw up two objectives and five power cards. Ooh. Let's roll for round two. I get. Ooh. Just single and double. Ooh, two it's singles. Two singles. Ooh. My choice again. It's enough. I think I'm going to let you go first. Curses. Okay. On my first turn, I'm going to charge with the champion. Champion! One, two. So he's going to slap the squig. <laughs> I'm not sure if that's a phrase. Uh, it's now. Got, it is now. Yep. The two hammers and two damage. Oh, one hammer. Sorry, did you save? Yep. No. Oh, no. So that's a dead squiggle. One dead squiggle. And I score what armour? Score immediately oh, nice. if a friendly fighter's attack with action with cleave succeeds. So I score and get a new objective. And in my power step, I'm going to play Undying <sighs> on the champion. What does that do? Plus one wound. Ah, so he's okay. now up to four. Wow. Anything for you in my power step, Robin? Oh, sorry, your power step. No, I've got nothing to do in your power step. Okay. So on to your first activation. Uh, I think I'm going to make a move action in my first activation. Okay. One, two, three, four. And in your power step? In my power step, I have nothing to do. Okay, I have nothing either, so on to my second activation. I'm going to use the Warden's ability to move two of my guys. I'm going to move the, Harvester, uh, the Prince of Dust one, two to there. And I'm going to move this guy one, two to there. 
and in my power step, I'm going to play the formless key mm. on Mr. Furcoat. Anything for you? Uh, no. Okay, so onto your second activation. My second activation. I'm going to move this guy. The fanatic. The fanatic. So it's four dice. You got the. the where are you no. going to place the template? I'll place the template here. So it's four dice, and you pick three of them. Ooh, mixed bag. Two hammers, crit and swords. Ah. You ham hammer crit, or hammer crit hammer, or crit <laughs> hammer hammer. Whatever you do, you end up in the same place. So power step, nothing. Okay. Nothing for me either, so onto my third activation. My third activation, I'm just going to move the warden Boop. onto that one there. And I have nothing to do in my power step. Okay, and so it's, my, it's your power step, isn't it? Still my power I'm step. going to play sneaky step. Ooh. Push through get that way. Ooh. Oh dear, heart champion. <laughs> you may be in trouble. And then on my third activation, you're going to swap him in the face. Look at him. Three hammers. Ooh. Two hammers. Crit required. Yes, a crit is needed. No. no. Two damage. Going to push him back? I am not. Didn't think you would. Because <laughs> you can't punch him in the face again <laughs> if he gets pushed away. Okay, so onto your power step. Power step, I have nothing. Same for me. So onto my fourth and final go. I'm just going to move Mr. Crawley out of the ground. One, two, to there. Get him away from the fanatic. And nothing in my power step either. So my fourth and final attack, I'm going to go for the champion. Yeah. Oh, Two looks. hammers. A crit will save me and that's it. So you're about to do a crit, I think. No. Oh. I am going to play Bone Shrap. Oh, so he takes a wound. Do one to Drizgit and the champion is out of action. Oh, and I get a glory. You do. Unfortunately, I don't want to score anything. No, I don't. No immediate scores for you. Very unusual for you, Robin. Mm -hmm. I played a very different deck this time, Pete. You may have noticed. Yes, it's rubbish. <laughs> <laughs> you sure it's not my deck? <laughs> That's normally my thing. Power step. I'm going to play Earthquake. Oh, you get back. No one takes Earthquake these days. I'm not sure the uh, sound effects were required, <laughs> but okay. They're worthwhile to me. And you're going to play Earthquake, because nobody takes it anymore. <laughs> no, I'm not. Okay. I haven't got it. I had not even considered the thought of Earthquake. But curse you. Curse you all the heck. Well done, sir. <laughs> well done. You've simultaneously buggered me up on two of my objectives. Oh, I have to say, I going back to the first turn, thank you very much for letting me play fungal blessing because if I hadn't the game would have been rubbish but well, I, that, I would have had nothing if I, if yeah. I, I don't think so uh, I have nothing else in the power step so on to the end phase what have you scored supremacy yeah yeah, yeah. Oh, that was all I could score this turn so I had to I had to work extra hard extra hard for it. I had a few other options up my sleeve but I was really jammy with this move got exactly what I wanted yeah <laughs> Nicely done, sir. And of your other two I'm objectives? I'm going to bin them because I've got making a statement. Oh. <laughs> making a statement and infestation in the same deck. Oh, that's that's committing. <laughs> and uh, shining example. Which you're very, you're going to struggle. <laughs> yeah. You are going to struggle. Can you with. imagine how exciting it would be if you managed to score making a statement and infestation oh. in the same turn? <laughs> yeah, that would be, <laughs> that be eight. Quite, well, you need to have a sauce on making, don't yeah, you? Yeah, you do, you, you do, really absolutely. You really do need that. Um, and then I'm going to bin Mad Cat Mushroom because uh, the magic unit is dead. Yep. Uh, and I think I'm going to keep these two because they may prove useful. Okay, so I scored nothing. You stopped me from scoring all the things I wanted to score. Um, I'm a jammy bastard. I'm, <laughs> I'm going to get rid of pure carnage. We are not going to kill uh, that many people next turn. Well, there's five dead at the minute. It only requires two more dead. 
But if I bring somebody back, then it requires three more dead yeah, and so on. So yeah. I don't think the chances of me, I don't think I want to score that. I just forgot the raise on Dirt with this deck. I'm going to keep my other two objectives. Supremacy scoreable for you. Yeah, I think so. I'm going to get rid of Ceaseless Attacks, which is play after a Freddy Fires attack, make an attack with somebody else. I've not got quite enough people near each other for that. And then I'm going to keep, then I'm going to draw up one objective and three power cards. It's time to roll for the third and final round. After you, Robin. Ooh, Ooh lots of doubles. A single or a crit will get it for me. There's the crits. Oh. You know what, I'm going to let you go first. Ooh, sneaky. Okay, I think I'm going to start by putting Drizgit on guard. <laughs> So you roll shields and swords, that was your first activation. Yes. Okay. Into your power step. My power step, and I've got nothing to do. Okay, I'm going to play. This is going to be comical. Uh, I've missed a dramatic pose, I'm going to play light armour. <laughs> Anything for you? No. Okay, I'm then going to play awakened weapon on him. Anything for you? No. And they're going to play demonic weapon on him. <laughs> so he now rolls three hammers, and he can re-roll one, and he does nice. three damage. Nice, that will kill him. That's what I'm hoping for. <laughs> Potentially. Well done if he does. So on to my first turn, and I'm going to have a go at him. Well, I would. So Mr. Dramatic Pose is going to have a go at um, Snurk, Sour Tongue. So because he has demonic weapon, he takes a wound. And then I get two dice normally, I get an extra one for light armour, and I can re-roll one dice because of Awakened Weapon. Oh, a crit and two hammers! Do I re-roll a hammer? Because if you roll two crits, you beat me. Or do you roll <laughs> Such a good roll, that is. Oh, not for me, because I... Oh, no, I can't re-roll that. I'm going to have to stick with that, so a crit and two hammers. So if I get two crits, I swear then you swear flip the table. Yeah. Oh, Ooh, that was close. Well, you've killed him. Snurk's been squirted. Well done. So I get a glory for that. Yeah. That nice paid work. off. That paid off. I wanted that Snurk away from me. I have a card which enables me to remake an attack if I fail. Uh, However, okay. I can't do that with the demonic weapon because it killed <laughs> Kill the petitioner. Has he only got one wound left? He has only got one wound left. Wow. Oh, that was. I needed that. So onto the power step, and I. I have nothing to play. Oh, there, I'll tell ya. I'm going to make a move action with Stick It here. No, that's not Stick It. That's. Whichever one dips. is. Dips. Yep. You move four. One, two, three, four. Look how much more agile they are once they inspire. They yeah. are quite speedy. Okay. On your power step? Uh, I've got nothing to do. Okay. So, on to my second activation. I'm going to bring back the harvester. <laughs> Not the Harvester of the Champion, and that does inspire him. Oh, and it's being returned to the battlefield. So that is my second activation done. And I have nothing in the power Which step. I, oh, I missed, didn't turn over on my third activation because you made me go first, didn't you? Yeah. Because you're like that. I am like that. Okay, I'm going to make a charge action with Drizky. Okay. One, two, three, four. Great, you can do that. God damn it. It's a risk. So it's three, three different dice. This is your dice. third activation. This is my third Charging activation. With Charging with Drizky. No, I do have four wounds, so. Yeah. Oh, a crit and a hammer. Smash. So that is two damage. Yep. And that will push you back. Ow. I have nothing to answer that with. And then I'm going to play Centre of Attention Ooh. on this guy here. Nice. Back on there. Nice. Now, he'll probably die. <laughs> oh no, because you'll kill him. <laughs> you'll kill your petitioner. Yeah, I can't hit you with you the petitioner. You can't hit with the petitioner. 
Okay, I'm going to play in your power steps, Hidden Paths. Ah, uh, hello. Right, right to there. <laughs> brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. <laughs> I'm not even, not even going to charge you. It's going to somehow reappear right next brilliant. to you. Brilliant. Uh, On to my third turn. Yep, I'm going to make an attack action. I might, I might <laughs> do that, yes. I've been thinking about it on I've charged over here, haven't I? So the champion rolls three hammers when inspired, and he has cleave, Ooh. but he does two damage. Oh, I've been have to kill him because he's had one wound already. I get a single assist, so Unless one single assist. And we go. Oh, it's so exciting. Single assist, two single assists. So I need a crit. You do. No, oh, so no. you've killed him. He already wounded. He's already wounded, yeah. <sighs> Dederated him. So I get I get glory for that, for deaderizing you. You do. Um, don't score any glory, uh, don't score any objectives, sorry. And in my power step, nothing. Uh, uh, anything for me in your power step? Uh, anything for you in my no, power step? Nothing for you in my power step, for whatever it is. <laughs> <laughs> whatever the whatever words, it is. Whatever the words are, just no. Yeah. Okay, on to your fourth and final activation. Fourth final activation. Seven Change. plays eight at the minute. I can't even remember what this objective is. <laughs> um, i trying to think what it might be. I don't think I can score it. I'm just going to draw a power card. Okay. You draw a lot less power cards with the bigger wall bands because yeah. you're just always wanting to do stuff with people. Yeah, I'm going to. Uh, I'm not, I think it's utterly futile, but I've got loads of glory left. So you're going to play. play acrobatic on. Uh, I'm going to put it on this guy over here. Okay. Job well done, Ace. It's either sticky or dibs, it's one of them yeah, two. Yeah. It's but definitely not red cap. Okay, that's the one I put it on. Okay. <laughs> So onto my fourth activation because I've got nothing to play. I'm going to use the Warden's ability to move two people. Oh, no. So I'm going to shift him forwards. I'm going to shift him over. So they've both moved. And maybe this time I get to score one of my objectives. You've got anything to do in your power step? Because I have something to do in yours. <laughs> if you stop me from scoring supremacy again. If only I kept a uh, centre of attention. Because <laughs> I actually no, I could have done it. Oh yeah. Uh, no, I don't think Yeah, I could have played the Warden and moved him off. Yes, you, yes, you could. Yeah. Have, yeah, and I nearly did, but I thought it was more fun to try and get it myself. I have only our only way out. Yep. I have nothing to play my power step. Do you? Uh, yes, I do. I have the hallowed key. Hallowed on, uh, key. One over there. Or one of the ones on an objective. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and have you anything? Hallowed key. Which one's that? Score two end points if you score objective one. Ah, very nice, very nice. Do you have anything? I do not. Okay, I also have the dadling key, Ooh. which is the same if I had objective four. Nice, you're going to place it on the guard on number four. Yeah. Very well done, sir, very well done. So we're on to the end phase, and you went first. I did, and you did enough. I couldn't score obliterated. No. I couldn't score keep them guessing because I couldn't no. get the fourth attack. Once you'd taken the uh, goblin out, the thingy out, I couldn't, I couldn't yeah. shoot. If, if he did been, a move, he did a charge. Prog had been there, if, if he prog hit that one hadn't been prog, I could have moved and then shot. Yeah. And it would yeah. have been enough. But I couldn't. And I didn't score any way out because you knocked me off. So I didn't score anything at the end. But there. you did get four. Yeah, I did for get four keys. for the keys. And I think the last objective there was martyred, which I knew I couldn't score because it's a score immediately. If the first fight's taken out in this section. In, in this round as a friendly fighter. So how many you got there? I uh, presumably you can't score that retroactively. I don't actually know that, but I assume you can't pick that up and then score it. You can't score it the minute you pick it up. No, but if you if you pick it up, and it. I think you can on the subsequent round score this immediately if the first fighter taken out of action in this round is a friendly fighter. So you would yeah, be able to draw it one round, uh, one activation. Yes, yeah, so there was no the point in drawing. So there's no point in drawing. Not I the fourth one. I, could, one, I no. couldn't think. Oh well, actually, uh, uh, you took the first guy out. Yeah, you could have. Could I? I don't know, actually. No, I don't know. I, I think seems you to me, can. Uh, can you? I think you can. If the first friendly fighter taken out in this round is a friendly fighter, not was. Interesting. Yeah. Yeah. I feel I'm like you sure. shouldn't be able to. I feel like you shouldn't be able to score it three three rounds later, but I might be wrong. I can't remember who the first person taken out this round. It wasn't me, wasn't it? Because you haven't lost anybody this round. Um... Yeah, yeah, I think it was. It was. Yeah. Well, let us know what in, in the comments. I don't know what if you something guys in, think, in yeah. the FAQ. I would, would have only got. Yeah. I would have got an extra glory. Well, we'll have to see if it makes a difference. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so I get one for the key. Yeah, well for done. For Mr. Kevin here. And so, what's the score now? I've got nine. Nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. You should have enough because you've got, and I've got supremacy. Three for supremacy. Uh, and if I had. If you had got that, I'd have had one more. It'd be twelve, and you'd have, and one, have one more objective. Of three objectives. Well played, well done, game. Sir. Well done. I really enjoyed I, that. I scored, I scored um, supremacy, obviously for the three. Yeah. Uh, I didn't score extreme flank, 
because wow. I was going to use hidden paths to. In fact, yeah. in fact, could I have done that still? I could use hidden paths on him. No, I could. You I used, used it to attack. I was going to use hidden paths to shift him over here. Yeah. yeah. Um, but then I used it to take out him in the end instead. Yeah. So rather than scoring two for extreme flank, I just got one for killing Drizkit. And then got well, you'd have got supremacy anyway, wouldn't you? And I got supremacy. I didn't score shining example because my other plan was I was going to raise my two guys from the dead, which would inspire my warden. Uh, and I've only raised one guy this this game. I have to raise. Well, two I had a very non-brutal game. band, really. Wow, I don't yeah. know whether I perhaps made a mistake by moving him across there, but it was more fun. Yeah, I could have well, sat back. What and, would have? I well, could have you sat back have and I could have used supremacy. I could have used com, uh, confu- I could have used the uh, centre of attention to move somebody off the supremacy. Yeah, I might have. Yes, yeah, so if you kept that won. till the very end, you would have stopped me scoring supremacy then. So I would have won. You yes, because yeah. you well yeah, and I wouldn't have got a glory for killing one of your guys. No. So it would have been four well, you glory might come the other way. Me, I suppose, but. No, I wasn't. I was, I was okay. determined to just sit on my objectives yeah, yeah, and just yeah. stay away so, from yeah, you. So I would have won, but yeah, I don't. I think it was boring to do that. <laughs> Poss- possibly, possibly. Um, I was trying to get. I was trying to be greedy. I was trying to get. Oh, uh, you've had the other mistake to get I do. Only way out as well. So eleven plays twelve, or possibly twelve plays twelve, and me winning on objectives. If you could score uh, martyrs, Martyred, which yeah. we you'd let us know what you guys think. But to be honest, if you hadn't let me play fungal blessing at the beginning, I think I would have been a very different game. Well, I can't remember no, now, different. but. I mean, you scored an extra wound on the champion. It, well, none of me would have been inspired because I only would have got two. Whatever I scored, I scored, I scored uh, extreme flank, but I wouldn't have had the extra glory to inspire them. So but you didn't. Um, it would have made a difference. Would it have made a difference? I think. Did you kill my champion in the first round? I don't think you did. I did because I blew him up. Did you? Because of that, yeah, it was the first round. Was it? You yeah. sure? I'm I'm ninety five percent sure it was the first round. Eighty five percent, sixty five percent. No, I'm pretty sure it was the first round because I, I had know. three at the beginning. I had three in the end of the first round. I had three glory. You did have three glory, yes. Yeah. But I don't actually, think... I'm not sure it would have made that much difference because I played Fameway Crystal and you killed my leader. So I don't know. That so actually, fair. I might have won. Yeah, you, you would have gone <laughs> ploughing off and then and then you'd be alive right now. It's hard to say. And I was really lucky. I've got lot, quite a lot of power cards left. I've got I drew, I drew three keys on the last turn oh, nice. and uh, they were two of the objectives that I had. Which, so that was, Thank you very uh, much. I was lucky. I didn't get some of my... I wanted Inspiration Strikes to inspire my Sepulchre Warden. Um... I had Slumbering Key, which I never used in the end. I had Restless Dead was near right at the bottom, which is to raise somebody for free. So that was right. that was stuffing me up as well. Um, I don't know if you did yourself out by having the boards offset. With your manoeuvrability. Well, I said, I, I think I might have set it up wrong. Yeah, I'm not sure. I wanted to make sure that I could score extreme flank when the time came, which no, was perhaps a that. mistake. Which perhaps a mistake. And the cards I still got left, I had Well Guarded, Dashed Hopes change of tactics and our only way out so I had two more I had one more score immediately and the rest were all pretty easy to score cards. I kind of figured with you having three objectives it didn't make much difference because it would be very unlikely I would score them oh, three, oh yeah. but I had hidden paths and the faintway crystal so there was a vague chance that I yeah. would be able to get over to your side of the board and pinch two and I had the destroyer objective one and I kind of thought well actually it doesn't really matter which way around the boards are set as long as it's not long ways true and, and especially with um, the destroy an objective, you could almost suicide Zarbag in. Does the destroy, destroy objective one have a range on it? It's one within four, isn't it? It's within four. So you could that's, suicide yeah, Zarbag yeah, in. Yeah, well, that's why I, that then, was my intention, although I, mis- I, I had the wrong episode. You had the wrong card. Oh, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, you could suicide him in, take one out. He might die. Yeah. But then, if, you're a po- if you know your opponent's going to be playing Supremacy or whatever, it immediately causes them yeah, grief. Yeah, it does. Yeah. Yeah, and if they've only got two in their half, and you take one out, then you could possibly score making a statement much easier as well. Yeah, very exactly. nice. Like and that. the centre of attention is a really nice card. I haven't really used it before. I kind of thought of it's really good for drawing people in, so you can hit them. So it's yeah. really good um, for the fanatic, and yeah, it was good for, for Gers- it'd be good for Gerzag or Bonecutter in in, in that, those type of but characters. It's also good for but stuffing really up good for, objectives. Yeah, assuming that there's enough. Uh, near yes, that's probably not so good for three player warbands. But, um, yeah, probably not so much. But but, but uh, for for stopping objective play, it's really handy, and because but it's got a whole a whole host of uses. Because I also used it to move here, and then I was. Uh, well, you knocked me off the objective. Oh yeah, no. Then what you I used was it to yeah, jump onto the objective. Yeah. I wonder whether you shouldn't have played it straight away. Ah, oh, but you'd have just gone back on the That's objective. That's true. I would have charged you and jumped onto yeah. the objective. Possibly, yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, so you but you can also use it to move. 
and then yeah, so and then and then go on, and then go on to Jiu Jitsu. Yeah, you've yeah, got like yeah. ready for action or something. Ready for action. Um, so I think it's got a, quite a versatile card. I quite like it. I think you were a little unlucky in that you jumped Zarbag over here, and I had ready for action. Yeah, yeah. So, well, that's just one of those things, isn't it? Yeah. yeah but I, I mean, really enjoyed I that. I'd love to play with that deck again. I'm not sure having uh, making a statement and uh, infestation oh. in it is a good idea. It's Do you know still... how much glory that's? Was twenty seven glory that deck? Bloody hell! I think mine was about eighteen or something. Um, that's the question is do you go for that kind of approach and you've got that a good deck for for going after objectives like i really like that idea that's really fun it's just it was really fun so maybe it needs a bit of honing but i think um the, the i think possibly, possibly you might have wanted to play the boards lengthways actually thinking you think? about it because you've got hidden paths and you've got yeah crystal. maybe yeah maybe and then you'd have yeah and spectral wings uh, maybe I'd yeah. probably need to play play with the deck a bit more. And, well, this uh, is the problem we have, isn't yeah, it? Yeah. That we we play two different warbands every week almost. Yeah. We rarely have the chance to actually sit down with with the warband and, and uh, play out. the same thing over and over and over again. So yeah. we don't get to. It wouldn't be very interesting for everybody to, uh, yeah, to watch the same warband every week. <laughs> no, uh, especially listening to me sound like Barry White either. So there you go. Hope we didn't miss too many uh, too many rules. I'm sure, there, we did. Got, yeah, we'll definitely definitely missed something and do let us know about the martyred card can you score that if you draw it later in the round we are I've got a feeling it unsure. might be in the FAQs uh, but might I can't be. remember we'll have to have a look at that and um, do let us know if you've got any questions about what we did or any of the rules or anything like that because you know sometimes some of you guys are quite new to the game and you want to ask us questions so ask away we we're do happy enjoy, to answer yep we do enjoy answering all of your questions all the time and um, Pete does anyway I don't, I don't know what Pete does in the daytime but I'll ask your questions try and pretend that I'm working so my boss doesn't <laughs> shout at me too much and then I just sit there on YouTube answering everyone's questions so I hope you enjoyed that guys and we shall see you back in the Mirrored City soon bye, bye.